morning, Sunrisers. I'm Dr. Karen Emerson, and today I have with me a very special guest. We have Santa's own veterinarian, Dr. Mistletoe, and with him is Santa's new puppy, Ollie, who has actually been training all year to help Santa deliver presents. So, Dr. Mistletoe, how is Santa doing? Santa is doing great. He's really excited about delivering all the presents and new pets, maybe, to the little boys and girls. And Ollie is going to go with him. And so I wanted you to take a look at Ollie today and his vaccination records to make sure everything that we have given him would protect him for all the worldwide travel that he's going to do Christmas Eve night. Well, that is such a good, a good question because, you know, as, as, as Ollie's going to be traveling, I know a lot of you are going to be traveling with your pets. So it's so important to make sure your pets are updated on their vaccines because a lot of people may not let, know your pets can get the flu and they can get something called kennel cough among other types of viruses. So what you need to do is make sure you get your records from your veterinarian, make sure the place you're going, um, get those records to them, and make sure your pet is updated. So if you are traveling, your pet, you don't have to worry about your pet getting sick. Another really important thing when you're traveling with your pets, and I'm gonna send some stuff for you for Santa, Thank is you. they may get car sick if they're not used to traveling or you have a young puppy that you just got for Christmas and you're gonna be traveling to a family's house. It's very important to make sure that you have something on board in case you think they're gonna get car sick or they've gotten car sick in the past. I've had dogs vomit. Sometimes they'll even use the bathroom in the car. So you need to make sure your pets go out and potty before you go on a long trip and make sure you, you, you map your trip out where you can have some rest area to go and allow your pets to use the bathroom and have a water supply. So that's another reason it's important to also have vaccines because you're gonna be stopping along the way, especially if it's a new trip. Another thing, make sure you take your own pet's food and the treats because you know at Christmas time, a lot of places that you go, especially if your pet has any dietary issues, you wanna make sure that they have a proper treat that's not gonna upset their stomach. Cause you don't wanna go to grandma's house, load your baby up in the car and then have upset stomach all the way home. So it's so important to take those kind of treats. And we're actually going to be sending, for Santa, we're going to be sending some treats and some vomiting meds just in case Ollie doesn't do too good on the sleigh ride. Thank you. So everybody out there, if you're about to get a new pet or you're getting a new pet for Christmas or you're traveling with a pet, give us a call. Let's make sure your pet's updated on vaccines and you're ready to go. And I hope you all have a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. WCBI Animal Health with Dr. Emerson was brought to you by Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point.